Happy Monday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Monday, April 15th. You pick a card. It's your main energy, but I pull them all together. Cards are for all of us. If you are an April 15th baby, I will do a reading for you next. All right. So if you pick card number one, you have the seven of wands. Thoughts and creativity are high for you today, but I want to say don't give up. You need to persevere a little bit longer. Don't rest on your laurels somehow and keep mosing it on. So, Because I do see choices, decisions for future plans. This could be even travel plans and great ideas. So this is a process, but you're on the road to it, okay? You need to implement something though too. It it's, could be just ideas now, but... You need to implement it, too. So it could be a delay in something as well. Okay. Card number two is the major arcana of strength. Okay. So important day for you. Children are in focus today. Children, new ideas, thoughts, messages may be important. Um, this is also a creative approach to something as well. You may hear some... Um, news. Maybe you're good, happy about it. Maybe you're not is what I'm picking up because there's too many energies there. You may come up with some new ideas too. Okay. Um, don't be your own worst critic. Cause I do feel that energy too. Um, you're going to find a new way of communicating with someone or someone is trying to communicate with you. They're trying to approach you, trying to message you. Um, they're trying to gain the strength to do so the nerve to do so. All right, so I do see that a lot of restless energy and um, overthinking some things. But these are sparks of new ideas, new um, messages, I want to say, and excitement. There could be some revolutionary ideas coming your way that could be very, very powerful, too, is what I'm picking up here, okay? People are inspired by watching what you're doing is what I'm picking up as well. All right, card number Three is the major arcana of the devil. So important day for you. You got a major arcana. All right. There can be a significant age difference in a love relationship. All right. So I do feel that for some of you, this is also someone who is abusive, is very toxic, a particular man uh, that's very domineering or brutal may be coming through today too that you have to deal with as well. Okay. Okay. Um, be careful of dealing with people in authority. It won't go well. Okay. So really, um, uh, be delicate and I would not, um, be, um, butt heads with anyone in authority today too. This is a time for you to also be strong. So you don't be tempted. Um, because I do feel here that you could be tested somehow or this is like um guilty by association the people that you hang out with may not be the best okay there is someone who could be very obsessive with you this person is dark obsessive and i don't like it and this could be a um like getting into a relationship that actually has ulterior motives so something to be careful of with um with this energy today okay um Follow the rules. Don't um, do anything illegal is what I'm picking up as well. Stay into the colors and the lines of the rules of the law. All right. When I'm looking at all of this, I do see money is involved today too. Lessons are involved today. Reviewing what worked, what didn't, and moving forward. And patience is going to be important. Creative thoughts are coming through. But we need to kind of prioritize our time as well and weigh out our decisions very carefully. Uh, we are presented with some challenge today. Okay. Protect what is yours. Protect your stand is what I'm feeling. Perseverance is important and maintaining control. If you lose control, try to maintain control. There could be some secrets and lies also around us and some extra responsibilities. Okay. That is the reading for today, Monday, April 15th. Have a fabulous Monday. Happy birthday if you're born today, April 15th. This is your solar year theme, and that is your wish card. And your solar year theme is the Knight of Pentacles, one of my favorite cards. It's slow and steady wins the race. That is my motto in life. 
I like to build my hard work into, um, I know I'm productive. So, and that always works for me. So this is definitely slow and steady wins the race. And um, some news may be coming in that you you may have to wait for a little bit longer or even some money or monetary um, reward is what I'm feeling here. Maybe you want to raise, maybe you want to change your job and, you know, something that is going to be more productive. Whatever you start working on is going to reap the rewards, though. It's slow and steady, though. OK, hard work and extra responsibilities are coming your way. A burden that you are carrying, you may have to carry a little bit longer. You need to get some rest and relax a lot and meditate this year, too. This is a time to retreat and um, re rejuvenate your um, energies. You may be also feeling lonely at times as well. There could be a continuance or a temporary separation from someone or something as well. I do see new social group coming in, too. I do see a victory and some kind of celebration coming up that's going to be significant. Um uh, this is also be careful of finances. You could have some financial loss um, or changes with work and um, feeling a lack of or insecurities. But slow and steady, have faith, things are going to work out for you. Um, I do feel you could be dealing with a Libra and a Taurus this solar year. You may be collaborating with someone as well. Um, you may be going through a lot of interviews, um, a lot of discussions, negotiations, and some settlements as well. Write things down so you don't forget them or to remind yourself. Make um, like like um, positive mantras or something as well. Your wish for your solar year is the Page of Swords. I do feel that this wish will not come true during the solar year. Okay. Um, important numbers for your solar year, 4, 5, 10, 3, and 33. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. And bye for now.